video, I will show you how to remove programs with the open with menu. So the, the problem which I have here is when I try to open a file with the open with menu, I got this annoying thing. For example, let's open this with another application. Open with, choose another app, and I have this annoying list. So what we're going to try here is how to remove this annoying uh, applications that you have you install, uninstall, uh, but they haven't been removed completely. So, in order to fix this, I found a very good website available from Nisoft. You can see here you can download uh, different applications, but we are interested in this uh, open with. So, you can find different languages. Uh, but in order to download the English ones, it will be above this language. You you will see that there is not it's not written English, but only download. So you see, I'm searching for English, but you see here, download open with view. So that will solve all your problems. Once you download this, open it, and you will see that it will appear all the list that you have with open with, right? No complicated things. That's the, the most easy way. Of course, the other way is from the registry, but this is the most safe way because for like this, you would disable them and you would, uh, wouldn't appear. Now, if you want to delete them, you have to keep up, still watching. If you don't want to risk it, better to stop here. But if you want to delete it from the registry, I will show you now what's the easy way to, or what you can search in order to delete from the registry. As you may see, it's easy if you, maybe you can use this tool so you can copy the process file name. So you can copy that, the process file name and search in the registry. So it would be only one area, one entry with this. Uh, it's really quite unique. So now I'm showing you that this is working. If you go open with, and choose another app, you will see that you don't have this annoying list which I was also having before. Therefore, copy this text here on the command line. Make sure copy this because it's very unique and then search in the registry. Search can take some time, but once you find it, that will be exactly what you need to delete. As you may see here, it's exactly the same list of applications of the application that is not disabled. This QT, QT player, which I have uninstalled and it was not removed from my open with list. And once to do another check, that will be another one. Copy, I mean, that will be a, the application and delete this. Once you delete this, you wouldn't see this again. And it's also clear from your history. For good. And you can check again, but I'm sure it wouldn't be. It's only two entries. So let me thank you. If you find this video useful, please like the video. And uh, if you are not subscribed, please subscribe. Thank you.